Genesis 27, verse 1, Isaac blesses Jacob. Now it came to pass, when Isaac was old and his eyes were so dim that he could not see, that he called Esau, his older son, and said to him, My son. And he answered, Here I am. Then Isaac said, Behold, now I am old. I do not know the day of my death. Therefore, please take your weapons, your quiver and your bow, and go out to the field and hunt game for me. And make me savory food such as I love, and bring it to me that I may eat, that my soul may bless you before I die. Now Rebekah was listening when Isaac spoke to Esau, his son. And Esau went to the field to hunt game and to bring it. So Rebekah spoke to Jacob, his son, her son, saying, Indeed, I heard your father speak to Esau, your brother, saying, Bring me game and make savory food for me, that I may eat it, and bless you in the presence of the Lord before my death. Now therefore, my son, obey my voice according to what I command you. Go now to the flock and bring me from there two choice kids, the goats, and I will make a savory food from them for your father, such as he loves. Then you shall take it to your father, that he may eat it, and that he may bless you before his death. And Jacob said to Rebekah, his mother, Look, Esau, my brother, is a hairy man, and I am a smooth, smooth-skinned man. Perhaps my father will feel me, and I shall seem to be a deceiver to him. And I shall bring a curse on myself, and not a blessing. But his mother said to him, Let your curse be on me, my son. Only obey my voice, and go, get them for me. And he went and got them and brought them to his mother. His mother made savory food such as his father loved. Then Rebekah took the choice clothes of her elder son Esau, which were with her in the house, and put them on Jacob, her younger son. And she put the skins of the kids of the goat, goats on his hands and on the smooth part of his neck. And she gave the savory food and the bread which she had prepared into the hand of her son Jacob. So he went to his father and said, My father, and he said, Here I am. Who are you, my son? Jacob said to his father, I am Esau, your firstborn. I have done just as you told me. Please arise, sit and eat of my game, that your soul may be blessed me. But Isaac said to his son, Who is that, that you have found it so quickly, my son? He said, Because the Lord your God brought it to me. Isaac said to Jacob, Please come near, that I might feel you, my son, whether you are really my son Esau or not. So Jacob went near to Isaac, his father, and he felt him and said, The voice is Jacob's voice, but the hands are the hands of Esau. And he did not recognize him because his hands were hairy like his brother Esau's hands. So he blessed him. And he said, Are you really my son Esau? Jacob said, I am. He said, Bring it near to me, and I will eat of my son's game, so that my soul may bless you. So he brought it near to him, and he ate, and he brought him wine, and he drank. Then his father Isaac said to him, Come near near now and kiss me, my son. And he came near and kissed him, and he smelled the smell of his clothing, and blessed him, and said, Surely the smell of my son is like the smell of a field which the Lord has blessed. Therefore may God give you of the dew of heaven, of the fatness of the earth, and plenty of grain and wine. Let people serve you, and nations bow down to you. Be master over your brethren, and let your mother's sons bow down to you. Cursed be everyone who curses you, and blessed be those who bless you. 